yeah welcome to another photoshop tutorial okay uh first thing i would love to introduce here this is the original image i'll be showing you guys how to change some of your old uh, pictures bring them to life <coughs> so this is the original image here and uh, this is the one we are about to change to you can see the the background here is almost the same with this one it's because I did not change anything from the original image you can see the the golden uh, light and adjustments that I have just done is on is on the body here you can see from the uh, previous and the after here and this is the third this is the second after sorry the second after the adjustments <coughs> sorry the adjustment is on both the background and the uh, lady here so let's go to photoshop so that i can demonstrate there so i want to open uh let's open our image here okay guitar so if you are if you if you want to adjust an image first you look at the <coughs> first you look at the image size that is the resolution you can see this one is 72 so we are going to change it to 200 okay control zero to zoom back okay by the time you zoom in you see that the pixels uh the pixels in the image has been uh, has been adjusted so go to your layer control j on your keyboard or if you are not using a uh, PC, you can uh, duplicate layer here. Just OK. So we'll be uh, adjusting this in uh, Adobe Camera. And in in some Photoshop version, like Photoshop CS6, doesn't come with uh, Adobe Camera. So it is advisable for you to use uh, Photoshop CC. So will be tempering with some adjustment here <coughs> so the highlights we're going to be uh, increasing it a little bit reduce the shadows okay now the temperature increase the temperature a little bit like 20% uh, okay you can see the colors that I'm telling you of, but we are still going to adjust some things there to make it real realistic so go to detail settings <clears throat> detail settings now increase the amount a little bit and luminance let's zoom this so that you can see what I'm talking of now luminance increase it a little bit to give it a blocky skin there yeah a blocking te texture so reduce this guy a little bit okay I think we're done here okay so the next thing i would love to do here is well let's try to separate this picture from the background so i'll be using a uh, quick max here quick max Okay. Let's try to reduce the size of the uh, quick max there. Adjust the edges. Make sure everything is covered. Okay. Here. so let's go to refine edge <coughs> let's adjust a little bit of our hair there okay on this side like so so go to refine edge refine edge and try to adjust the sides 
so the feather you can set it to 0.2 and uh, the contrast increase it a little bit uh, uh, click on the uh, the contaminated colors there and the feather then increase it so by the time you are done just uh, click OK so I like it to come up if you take some little time allow those things to apply on the image there so okay you can see from the previous uh, pictures that I've displayed to you there you can see that uh, the, the picture the picture has its color there it's separate from the background let me hide the background so you can see mm -hmm. this is the before and this is the after so we are going to add some little shadows there to make it realistic a little bit there so we'll be using a brush tool right click increase the brush size okay the four background is white press x on your keyboard to switch between both uh, colors there and highlight it make sure your flow your flow is for the eight percent just to make it a little bit darker okay now bring the layer below the image there okay so we're going to be creating an exposure on her skin <coughs> sorry we'll be creating an exposure on her skin there so uh make sure this this her layer is selected now create a new layer and go to edit a uh, fill make sure it's 50 percent gray click on ok now change the blending mode to uh overlay press b on your keyboard or locate the brush to here okay sorry uh dodge to here now let's zoom in a little bit i'm going to be creating an highlight there so make sure your full background is uh white or so so paint like so so we want the highlight there to appear at those sides there so that it will make it look more realistic these details are going to be very sharp very sharp very sharp so just paint over those sides i know you can't see what i'm doing but let me toggle let me toggle off the switches so that you see now this is the before this is after you can see there are some lights on her arms and legs so all of those things are uh, are important in editing all of those pictures so this come to an end to uh, of this tutorial thank you i hope you enjoy my tutorial please subscribe to my channel goodbye